the 10 largest transformers. Today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 largest transformers. But before that, let's have a little insight into what's been going on in the Cybertronian saga so far. Like we all know, the Decepticons are easily one of the biggest, baddest armies of bad guys in all of fiction. They're giant robots that transform into vehicles, usually military vehicles, with big honking weapons, capable of blowing away anything that tries to stop them from achieving their goals of complete domination of the universe and eradication of all non-Cybertronian life. Fortunately, standing in their way are the Autobots. While they don't usually look anywhere near as cool, they've managed to stand in the way of the Decepticon forces for millions of years, keeping mushy organic life like us safe. But that's not accomplished without having some pretty good soldiers on your side. So let's now start the countdown of the 10 largest Cybertronians that have appeared in the series so far. Number 10. Slug. 71 feet. So the first Transformer on our list today is Slug. Okay, it's not the usual slug we typically see in our gardens every day, because this slug is a Dinobot from the live-action series Continuity and is undoubtedly one of the largest in the entire Transformers universe. Slug doesn't like you and he doesn't like your face. Don't bother trying to give him orders unless they involve headbutting an opponent into next week. And don't bother trying to make peace with him because he wants a fight and he's going to start it on your face. Number 9. Demolisher, 74 feet. The gigantic Demolisher may not be the sharpest tool in the shed, but he's smart enough to know when to fight openly and when to stick to the shadows. One of the Constructicons, Demolisher, arrived on Earth to find Megatron dead, so he went into hiding, gathering other Decepticons who needed a big, blunt instrument to cower behind. Now in charge of this little band, he awaits the day when a new Decepticon leader will rise. Demolisher takes the ninth spot on our list. Number 8. Scavenger, 75 feet. So, at number 8, we have Scavenger, the Decepticon Constructicon from the Revenge of the Fallen portion of the live action film series Continuity Family. It was a beast of a Transformer, and Scavenger transforms into a Terex ONK RH400 excavator. When combined with his fellow Constructicons, he forms part of the upper torso of Devastator. Number 7. Grimlock Bot Mode 84 feet. Taking the seventh spot in our list of the largest Transformers is an Autobot that goes by the name of Grimlock. Grimlock has a rather rough and tough attitude. One of the most powerful warriors alive, his general approach to a problem is to smash it first, worry about the specifics later. This attitude extends to his Autobot companions, who are expected to meet Grimlock's standard of strength. That said, the Autobots have a lot less to fear from this behemoth than the Decepticons. Number 6. Scorn Bot Mode 90 feet. Scorn is what happens when you combine a destructive war machine with a Predator. His robot mode resembles a knight with a tail forming a powerful spear for his right hand, while the head becomes a gauntlet for his left. Nothing else so much as a destroyer on two legs, he's strong and massive. Scorn is an Autobot who's also a demolition specialist and wields the Scrapmaker sword in bot mode. His massive size makes him almost impossible to bring down. Number 5. Devastator 108 feet. Taking the fifth spot in our list is the Giants Among Giants, the Devastator. In fact, he's so huge that his body simply cannot support itself when carrying his weight upright, forcing him to lumber on all fours. Devastator is a tormented being, his very formation racking his component Constructicons with pain and stressing them to the breaking point both physically and mentally. The imperfect fusion process produces a mind that's very much less than the sum of its parts. Rage and pain is all he knows, pushing aside whatever intelligence he might possess. Number 4. Grimlock Dinobot 140 feet. Grimlock Grimlock is an Autobot Dinobot from the live action film series Continuity Family, and his Dinobot form is a large Cybertronic Tyrannosaurus. Titan's bio for Grimlock says that he was given his Dino mode during Shockwave's experiments, which left him low on intellect. Different Grimlock there, 
As for how huge it is, Grimlock is more than three times as large as a real Tyrannosaurus, so it's pretty darn huge to say the least. Number 3. Scorn – Dinobot – 150 feet So the first Transformer taking the medal-winning place is the Cybertronic Spinosaurus Scorn. Scorn, aka Spike, is a member of the Dinobots that appeared in Transformers – Age of Extinction. This Autobot can take the form of what appears to be a Spinosaurus, so you can bet it was pretty huge. Although he's the demolitions expert, Scorn is the least intelligent of the Dinobots. Maybe size does take a toll on some things. Number 2. Dragonstorm – 300 feet Taking the second spot in our list of the largest Transformers is Dragonstorm, who's an Autobot, a beastly three-headed dragon, impressive full form of the legendary Twelve Knights of Iacon, who oppose Quintessa. The three-headed mechanical dragon is a beast of a Transformer that can even take flight and destroy Decepticons mid-air despite its size. It's like a super-advanced version of the Mecha King Ghidorah. Number 1. Driller – 1,080 feet well, there shouldn't be much of a doubt over which Transformer is the largest. It was going to be Driller anyways because it's simply a notch higher than the rest when it comes to size. The Driller is a Decepticon from the Dark of the Moon portion of the live-action film series Continuity Family. Alongside Devastator and the Dinobots, the Driller is by far one of the largest Transformers in the entire movie universe. And fun fact, a working name for the Driller was Colossus. So that brings us to the end of our list. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.